Guys, I've been telling y'all that we should have came here earlier. It's not my fault I didn't expect it to be this nice out here. Well, now you know. Also guys, ever since I left my apartment, I've been feeling sick. I'm going inside the cabin to sleep real quick. Sorry guys. It's okay. Me and Jessica will be out here. Have a good rest, Francisca. Did you notice? Notice what? How Francisca has been acting lately. I'm starting to get worried. She won't even pick up her phone anymore. It's almost like if she was possessed. I think I should go check up on her. She will be fine. She just needs some alone time. How would you know that? You barely care about her. No, Jessica, I didn't mean it like that. Francisca, are you doing okay? Francisca? Oh, I'm sorry for bothering your sleep. I was getting worried for a second. Hello? Francisca, can you hear me? I need to find my phone. What is this book? Where did you go? Francisca, this isn't funny. I've always wanted to stab you and climb inside your bodies. No, no, no. <laughs> Jessica, are you okay? Oh my god, Jessica. What is that? Isn't that Francisca? What are you doing, Francisca? Did you kill Jessica? Jessica, you're alive. In your dreams. No, don't do this, Jessica. You guys are insane. Cassie, did you know this apartment used to be haunted? Haunted by what? By a guy who killed himself in this building a long time ago. Danny stopped trying to scare Cassie. So the story Danny just told is fake, Bridget? Yes. It's real. You can even look it up online. No, it's not. Guys, stop arguing. You guys are siblings. You should never go against each other. Bridget, can you go get that? Sure thing, Mom. Danny, where did you find that story at? Online. It was in an old newspaper that I found from this location. Hey, Bridget. How have you guys been? Oh my god, Aunt Beth. I haven't seen you in a while. We've been good. I'm glad to hear that. May I come in? It's raining badly over here in California. Yes, of course. My mom is in the kitchen right now. What's up, sis? Oh my god, Beth, when did you get into the city? I got an Uber from the airport to here. How have you guys been? I've missed you and Beth. We've all missed you. Well, not almost everyone missed you. Hey. Be nice or you won't get a gift. Speaking about gifts, I bought y'all's dad something. What's wrong? Why is everyone quiet? Danny, go get my car keys and buy some pizza with your sisters. Whatever you say, Mom. I guy hate that garage door. Won't open. Click the button correctly, Danny. Oh! I'm so sorry for your loss. Thanks, but a sorry won't fix his death. 
So I have to start packing up to move out of this place. After his death, everything went downhill. I lost my only person I truly loved. The kids lost their father. Danny kept getting in trouble in school. I can barely afford rent. Why didn't you call during his funeral or before? I could have helped you guys with the process. I did call you, but you never responded to any of my texts or calls. But I didn't try finding you and dragging my problems to you. What is that supposed to mean? Look Beth, I'm not trying to argue with you today, but I know why you're here. I'm not that stupid enough to believe that you would be here to help us with our problems. What are you talking about, Ellie? I know you're pregnant again. You did this last year ago too. You came to my house acting like you wanted to help with rent and stuff but all you wanted was to get advice and help on what to do. Maybe you're right, I shouldn't be here. Wait, I just got a flood drill due to all the rain there's going to be a flood. Where's Danny and the kids? Oh no, I send them to get pizza. Finally, we're back home. Hurry, let's go, it's raining Danny. It's a flood siren, hurry, we have to go inside to the higher ground. Danny. I'm over here, Danny. Danny, let's go, hurry. Come on, Danny. I'll be right behind you guys. Let's go, Cassie. What is this? Why did I hear my name? I should take it, it looks like it could be worth money. I could help out mom with rent for a month now. Is that red paint? I have to get out of here. Come on stupid elevator open. They're going to be okay Ellie. They are smart kids. This is all my fault. I should have sent them out by their own. I'm a bad mother. You would have never known that was going to happen Ellie. It's not your fault. Mom. Mom. Oh my god, you guys are okay. I'm so sorry I should have never sent you out. It's okay mom, we're just glad we're back home. You see Ellie, I told you, you have some smart kids. Mom Bridget dropped the pizza. I love you guys more than pizza. I'll head back to my apartment. Danny, I think you should put this back. This could be worth money, Bridget. Just think about it. We could help out mom with this. I don't like the pages of that book. Promise me you will put it back where it belongs. Hey guys, what are y'all up to? Let me guess, some silly projects. It's this book Danny found by the garbage of the garage. It's not garbage. It can be actually worth something. Danny, I think Bridget is right. You should put this book away where you found it at. Fine, I was just trying to help out mom. By trying to sell garbage? Betty Boo, I'm going to put laundry away. Isn't there flood still? No, it was just a drill. Just be in charge that Cassie doesn't do nothing or that Danny and Bridget don't fight. I'll be back, it won't take long. I'm going to search Google what type of book this is. The Book of the Dead is a book with powerful spirits and more. That's weird. Guys, I have a bad feeling about this. Danny, what was that? I don't know my phone's speaker is going off. My phone just cracked. How is the audio still playing? 
Why is the lights flickering a lot? Someone help me. Get me out of here. Please, someone. What was that noise? Danny and Beth? Are you okay, Cassie? Yes, but what was that noise? Did everyone hear that? It was maybe the thunder. What if it was the book? I mean, are we going to ignore the fact that Danny's phone broke on its own while an audio still playing? What book? It was nothing. Cassie, you should start going to take a shower and go to sleep. I don't know why you guys' mom is taking so long. Okay, and Beth. I had the most beautiful dream. What's up, sis? We were together sitting in a tall forest. It was the perfect day and all I could think about was how much I wanted to cut you all open and climb inside your bodies so that we can stay one happy family. <laughs> you don't look so good, Mom. Mommy is with the maggots now. Bridget, look out. You're going to die, you pathetic girl. Aunt Beth, do something I don't want to hurt, Mom. Get off of her, Ellie. Hello, is anyone there? I heard screams. We have to lock the door. I'm scared and Bess. Is mom going to be okay? I don't know, Cass. You don't think mom looked like one of those images in the book? This isn't my fault. Yes, it is you started all of this by opening that book when I told you not to. Answer me, Danny. Stop going against each other. Didn't you guys' mom ever tell you not to do that? You guys are siblings. <laughs> Oh, there you are. Hey there, cutie pie. You don't look so good, Mom. Nothing but a big old hug and kiss from you won't fix. Open up now. I don't feel good, I need a glass of water. We got to clean you up. You will be a good mom someday, honey bath. Oh yeah? Yeah, you know how to lie to kids. <laughs> Bridget, are you alright? Aunt Beth. Go to y'all's rooms. Bridget, this can't be happening to you. Say cheese, you ungrateful liar. Aunt Beth. Get away from her, Bridget. Beth, your leg, it's all scratched up. We need to take you to a hospital. We're still trapped inside. Ellie is still out there. Turn it on, Cass. No, wait, Cassie, my sister, don't do this to me. They're trying to make you think I'm the monster. I know you aren't my sister anymore. <laughs> Ah! 
Is she dead? Nothing can kill me. Bridget, don't do this to us. I told you, Danny, you should have put the book back. Hey, Bridget, come for me. I'm getting us out of here, I promise. Danny, don't go, please. I'm sorry, Cass. No, Danny. Stay with us. We should start running. Don't listen to her, Cass. She doesn't know how it costs to bring a child to this world. I know you aren't my mom anymore. Run, Cass. Run. Betty Boo! Oh my god, that man's dead. Everyone dies by Don Beth. Let's get out of here. There's no way out. Wait, the elevator. Follow me. of this mom will come back, right, Bess? I don't know, Cass. I'm really scared. Bess, there's blood dropping. Hold still. Are we going to drown? I won't let that happen to us. Cassie. Bess, is that you? Yes. It's me, thank goodness you're okay. Come on, Cassie, we have to get out of here. The gate won't open. Come on, Cassie, let's go by running. Hurry up, Cass, they could come back any minute. Dead by dawn. Dead by dawn. Dead by dawn. Dead by dawn. Run. I'm ready to finish this once and for all. I'm on my way over there. Okay. Just don't be late, bye. Francisca. Hello, is there anyone there? Who just called my name? 